In this short video, I'm going to be showing you how to password protect your settings on your Android device. Now, for this video, I'm using a Samsung S23, so please keep that in mind because the process for what I'm about to show you might look a little bit different depending on the type of Android device that you have. So, by default, Samsung or any other type of Android, they don't have a password protecting feature. So, we are going to have to make use of a third-party application. Now, I've done the research and I think the best one for the job is called AppLock. As you can see, it's right here on my home screen. It's free, it's super easy to use, it's very convenient. And I'm gonna show you how to password protect your settings right now. So click the AppLock application once you've downloaded it. And this is the first screen that you are gonna see. It's gonna ask you to draw an unlock pattern. So we're gonna set one up right now, just like this. Then it's gonna ask us to confirm it. And the reason it's asking us that is because that's the pattern that we're gonna use in order to access our settings. Now, agree to start, and then don't allow. And as you can see, uh, on the right hand side, you can see the little padlocks, they're currently unlocked, meaning that none of the applications here are locked. And the reason for that is because we haven't given the application the correct permissions to do that. Now, in order to give it the permissions, what you need to do is basically just tap on any application and then click on the permit button. And then right next to app lock, click on the little widget icon. And then that's going to give it the permission. Do the same for the second one. And from here, we just need to find the settings application. It's right here. As you can see, it's already actually locked by default. So I'm going to unlock it quickly just to show you what it looks like. So it's going to look like this. And then to lock it, basically just tap on the uh, padlock and it will give a notification that it's now been locked. And just to test it out, we're going to head back to the home screen. We're going to click on settings. And as you can see, before it prompts you to the application or to the settings, it's going to ask you to enter the password that we just set before. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's how to password protect your settings on your Android device. If you have any questions, let me know down in the comments below and I'll be more than happy to help.